So what made you start the coffee business? Well, I saw a niche in the market. I saw the Mr. Whippy trucks going around. And uh, I realized that's how big coffee was here in Australia. So I said, okay, I'm going to buy a Mr. Whippy truck and take out the ice cream machine and put it in one of these babies here and uh, away I went 18 years ago and still going strong now there's a mobile cafe pretty much in every little small town across Australia and uh, yeah still enjoying it still having fun still doing these weekend festivals here at the, the Crookwell Potato Festival and uh, yeah no looking no looking back had a good time uh, well we just don't do coffee we had to you know do a few more things other than that because there's so many people doing coffee now so we do our hot food pie sausage rolls spinach and feta rolls ham and cheese croissants Filo pastries, and we do our professional, the Michelangelo art of gelato, which is uh, very popular. Plus, we do our cakes and muffins and slices and wraps and fruit salads, and uh, we do a beautiful uh, Thai beef salads and uh, a variety of vegetarian things as well. Fantastic! And so you got your chai lattes and everything else like that. Yeah, chai lattes, hot chocolates, a variety of tea, herbal teas, and uh, yeah, we do all types of coffees, iced coffees, and iced chocolates. And and where are you you from originally? I'm from the east coast of Canada, uh, province of New Brunswick. <laughs> Probably haven't heard that, have you? It's a small little province on the, right on the Atlantic Ocean side. Do you do some Canadian treats? Yeah, yeah, we do uh, the Canadian pancakes and stuff as well, and uh, our version of the Canadian shepherd pie. We don't have a whole lot of things uh, in Canada as far as food goes, really. You know, we do our pies and sausage rolls and stuff as well. It's uh, much easier um, to live over here. You don't have to wake up two hours before you have to go to work to shovel your driveway. You have to get to work. And, but uh, unfortunately, when you're going to school here as a kid, I guess you don't get your school days uh, off when it's snowstorms. <laughs> Thanks for chatting.